Hey guys, welcome back to Azure Plays Pokemon Leaf Green, and today I am in Fuchsia City. Last time I cleared both route paths to Fuchsia City, and I did not mean to go back into the Mart, but I went to the Mart and they sell Ultra Balls, and they also sell Max Repels. So I went and bought a couple, but now that we're at the Safari Zone area here, and we're also at Fuchsia City Gym, we could go and get my fifth badge, since I kind of sequence broke, apparently, last few episodes, and, uh... Well, not, like, really broke, but I got a badge early, technically. You can do them in any order, apparently, according to what most people are saying, but... Let's do this gym, shall we? Yo, champ in the making. Fuchsia Gym is a tricked up place. It's riddled with invisible walls. Koga might appear close, but he's blocked off. You have to find gaps in the walls to reach him. Alright, so there's a bunch of invisible walls here. And that clearly says that there's not invisible walls there. Let's see you beat my special techniques. Let's see what kind of Pokemon he has, shall we? Juggler Nate would like to battle. He sent out a Drowsy. Alright. A level 34 Drowsy? Let's just use a Razor Leaf, that should be fine. I am 11 levels higher. I think that's enough. A critical hit, so that one's down. What else you got? A Kadabra, okay. Getting fancy. It's like another Psychic Gym going on here. Critical hit. Did I just critical hit twice? It's kinda neat. You had me fooled. No, I just critical hit twice. Okay, let's see here. Koga is right there, but I can't directly access him. Strength isn't the key for Pokemon. Do you understand this? Pokemon is about strategy. I'll show you a strategy can beat brute strength. Well, yeah, it kind of is. I mean, I kind of do have my Pokemon team planned out a little bit, but not to the point of where everyone else has it planned. Where they can sit there and, like, do, like, those weird sort of challenges. I'm just trying to catch them all. Okay, that didn't do anywhere near as much damage as I would have hoped, so let's go with Tackle. That didn't do as much damage either. It's probably because it's level 38, and I did not know that was super effective. So, let's go for a Razor Leaf. Okay, you're gonna meditate. Raise your attack, but it might be too late for you. Razor Leaf. All right, Hypno fainted. What extraordinary? Eh, I just did good. Okay, let's see. I was a magician once upon a time, but I dreamt of becoming a ninja, so I joined this gym. Okay. Juggler Kirk would like the battle. He has four, and it's probably all drowsy. <laughs> So, I will just go and do the Razor Leaf. Bulbs is probably not the best person to have in this point in time, but... Brute Force sometimes beats strategy. It just depends on the kind of Brute Force. If it's an overpowered Brute Force, strategy might not always work. I mean, right now it's kind of a Batman versus Superman kind of deal going on. The only difference is, with Balls being Superman, with him being overly powerful, but not have the best advantages because Drowsy has a Kryptonite to use. He could, and Kadabra, he could use Psychic and it would eliminate Balls rather quickly. But they just gotta use it. If they don't use it, then it's not a good strategy. See? Well, that was a one-hit KO, so that's a different story, but they need to use their Kryptonite. They need to put the green on the green. Nope, they're still meditating. They're not learning. It's like Batman before he actually became, like, good at his job. 
It's like when he like first put on everything and he wasn't like quite there yet. I'm done for. Well, you gave it your best shot. Let's see, there's another dude. I also studied the way of the ninja with Master Koga. Ninja have a long history of using animals. Eh, the only one I think they really use often is like a dog. I don't know about a snake though. That's that's kind of um a unique choice for a ninja to use. Oh well, just use razor leaf. These ninjas use leaves a lot. They like disappear and they turn into logs, sometimes leaves. They sometimes put like leaves on their head and they like change. Well, that's kind of eh. <laughs> they use leaves sometimes. <laughs> Sand Slash, okay. That's not really much of a ninja e Pokemon, but... Super effective, and it went down. Another Arbok, okay, so... I'm not sure what your fighting style exactly is, other than using animals, but... Whatever, I critical hit that. Critical hit not very effective, so I just basically did about normal damage. So I'll just razor leaf it. Oh, got one more. I could probably use a tackle. So, tackle. Woo! Okay, that's kind of weird. Uh, let's go this way. There's a guy right there, and one right there. Stop right there! The famed invisible walls of Fuchsia Gym have you frustrated? Ah, uh, not really. I haven't really been paying attention, I'm just kind of walking. But with you having a Sand Slash, I'll just use Razor Leaf. Super effective. And what else do you got? An Arbok. Okay, I'm not gonna switch. I know Razor Leaf doesn't do much, but I do have Tackle. So I can use Tackle. Okay, that did nowhere near as much damage as I would have hoped. Razor Leaf does more for a not very effective attack. Which makes no sense to me, but whatever. Okay, I might have to switch. So bulbs, let's see if you can get rid of this Arbok here real quick. And then you can call it a day. There you go, you did it. Yep, I do have it. But... Bulbs is kinda paralyzed. In case... I might need to bring him back out. Do I have a paralyzed... Uh, paralysis heal anywhere? I do, I have one. Okay, perfect. Okay, he's cured of paralysis, but I'm gonna swap him out. Let's see here. Kingsy, why don't you show your stuff? Master Koga comes from a long line of ninjas. What did you descend from? I don't know. What did I descend from? Sean sent out a drowsy. Alright, let's see. I think I might be at a type disadvantage again, so I'm just gonna use horn tech. Unless he decides to use headbutt. And now you're poisoned. How do you feel about that? Horn attack, shall we? A hypno, okay. Let's see what you got with that. 
Or attack, shall we? Okay, you're raising your attack. So let's see what you're gonna do with that. I'm gonna use another horn attack, let's see what you do. You're gonna raise your attack again? Good, you're trying to knock me out on one hit. But let's see how that goes for you when I use another horn attack. And Hypno is gone. Alright. In the meantime, there's something I would like to do. Resties, you're getting, uh... You're getting pretty powerful with, uh, that. So, Mauser, let's give you some more respect and some more levels by giving you that EXP share. I'm pretty sure you'll level up pre pretty dang quickly here. But, in the meantime, Koga... Fwahaha! A mere child like you dares to challenge me? The very idea makes me shiver with mirth. Very well, I shall show you true terror as a ninja master. Poison brings steady doom. Sleep renders foes helpless. Despair to the creeping horror of poison type Pokemon. Alright, well let's see what you can do, because your gym was filled with psychic types. A coughing, alright. Kingsy, show them what you got. Horn attack. I'm not doing too much damage, but a few more should do it. Koga's first coughing. Does he have more? I don't know. I don't remember what he's supposed to have. Let's find out. A muck. Okay. Not a big deal. Muck, let's do this. I'm gonna use horn attack. I almost used double kick. But then I remembered, for once... It is not very effective against these kind of Pokemon. Horn attack. <sighs> That's not gonna make this any easier. Ah, great. Evasion and defense. This is gonna be quite a bit. Wait, wait, wait. They gave me an idea. Kingsy. Let me, uh, bring you back real quick. If you're gonna be doing that, tapes show them what you got. Psychic. Okay, tapes, you can do it. Psychic. Good, you hit. It's super effective with any amount of defense and evasion, as long as I hit you. That's pretty much... Uh. Psychic, please. Okay, so you're using a Hyper Potion on a muck. Okay, so this is your big bad. But I have super effective attacks, so... As long as I can last. I just need one more hit. Okay, tapes. Good try. Let's see, what else do I got? Bird, show them your aerial ace. Or wing attack. Or you can use a second hyper potion. Great. Uh, let's use one that doesn't miss. It may not do a lot, but all the evasion in the world will make it useless against a move that always hits. Defense, on the other hand, though, that's getting annoying. Great. Okay, bird, you have some time. Ariel ace that. He's in yellow now. He's using sludge. Nah, okay, a critical hit. Great. 
Come on, you can do this. Okay. <sighs> Dang it, bird. You gave it a good shot. Let's see, who else could have used? Mauser's a little bit not powerful enough. But Resties. Let's see what you can do. Body slam. Oh, great. <sighs> Come on, really? Body slam. Okay, that didn't do anywhere near as much as I would have hoped. Okay. Your health is draining stupidly fast. Use a rest. Alright, you snore for me. Great, this is not going well. Snore. Come on, you can hit. It's a noise. There's no way you should be able to, hit, like, miss. Any flinched. Okay, good. So. Great. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna rest again because my health is really low. If you're going constantly use hyper potions, I'm gonna constantly refill my health. So let's use sleep talk. Okay. Three out of four chances and you went with the one that does that. You can do this. Come on! Are you serious right now? Are you serious right now? I knew you were going to wake up. I had a feeling. It's a body slam. Thank you. Okay, coughing. I am not switching. I got this in the bag. I just need to rest again. And then, let's go for a snore. Alright then. <sighs> snore please for me. One more ought to do it. Or you can wake up. Alright then, you're gonna self-destruct on me? Okay, you're ending it with a wheezing. Level 43 wheezing. I'm gonna use rest. Please, please, please. Okay. Okay. Well, there goes the poison. Now I'm sleeping. Alright, so I'm gonna use Snore again. Can't poison me when I'm sleeping, I don't think. Just keep at it with the snores. Just keep snoring away. It's all you need. Resties, you are my champ right now. You can do this. Here's another snore. Okay, you woke up. So, let's see what you can do. Use a rest. There you go, right back up the fool. And now, use another snore. Alright. You should be able to get two more, I'm hoping. One more, you can do this. 
Okay, you woke up again. So... Let's get one more rest. I think you should be fine. Alright. Use a sleep talk. We're running out of snores. There you go. Perfect. That's what I was hoping for earlier. Hmm. You've proven your worth. Here, take the soul badge. Now that you have your soul badge, the defense of your Pokemon rises. It also lets you surf outside of battle. Ah, take this too. See what that TM06 lies toxic. It's a secret technique dating back for some 400 years. Okay then. Well. So apparently the defense of my Pokemon rose. I don't know how true that is. I don't know if that actually does that. Because I don't think a badge can make your Pokemon get higher level defense like that. But if it does, that's nice. So. I kind of ran out of time. Trying to... Because that, that gym took me a little bit longer than I thought I was going to. So, I'm going to say next time on Azure Plays Pokemon Leaf Green. Let's go explore that Safari Zone. See what I can catch. See you guys then.